Hello, everyone. You see these two boxes right here? These two boxes aren't my boxes. These two boxes were um, given to me. Actually, I borrowed these from a friend. Um, she gave them to me about, let me think, about five months ago, I think. She hasn't asked for them since. All right, let me just show you what they are. They're CD boxes. These bad boys hold CDs in them. Let's open up. Look at some of the CDs. And, whoop, we already have CDs dripping out. CD galore. Oh, dang. They're just all over the place. I've opened this bad boy many times myself. This some of the CDs in here. Because me and her have kind of the same taste. A little bit. Music. The first one we got is a band called Ace of Rise. And according to this one, this one's called The Sign. Haven't listened to that one. Many of these I haven't listened to. Let's see some of the ones she's got right here. We got Static X. I've heard of them. We got... Guess who this is? This is, um... What's his name? Kid Rock. We got Elo Fleetwood Mac. Eric Mac. Eric Clap Moment. We got Puddle of Mud. Come Clean. And we got... I can't even read it. It says Natalie Merchant Tyberry. And I think that's what it says. This one we got right here is Ramstein. Oh, it's upside down. I don't know what this album's called. I don't. I think this album's called Republic. I think that's what it's called. We got Matchbox 20. Yourself or someone like you. Deftones, White Pony. I wish it was around in the fur. I really want that album. We got White Zombie. We got Seven Dust. I think that one's called Seasons. That I can't remember what this sounds called. We got Corrosion Mud Vein and Alex. I can't tell you what's on that. We got Godsmack's Faceless. And we got Soundgarden Bad Motor Finger. I've heard that one. That's that that album kicks butt all the way. And we got Molly Hatchet Greatest Hits. I've heard one Molly Hatchet song. I don't really like it. And now, don't ask me who this is, but this is Fat Cat Mix Part 1. I don't know who Fat Cat is. If I ever see her, I'll ask her who he is. And then we got Fat Cat Mix Part 1. Fat Cat Greatest Hits Volume 1. Fat Cat Mix 2. That one says, Same uh, 3 Remix. Master for Disc 3 Remix. Fat Cat Mix 3 Remix of Disc 2. We got Fat Cat Mix 4. Fat Cat Mix 5. Pat Mix 1. Boom Boom Rap. Weird Mix. Country, ra Rock, Rap, Techno, and Funky. And then we got Casey Mix CD 5. Casey Mix CD 4. 6, I meant. And we got Disturbed. It just says Disturbed on it. We got Disturbs Believe. We got Mudvayne. And we got Mudvayne, the beginning of all things to end. I've actually listened to that one. The last song on here called LD50. That song, 17 minutes, 15 seconds long. I remember listening to this CD for the first time. I was listening to Halfway Through it. I'm like, why the heck is this song or this song so long? And I look, and it's 17 minutes long. Yeah, it was not a fun experience. I already had this album. The only reason why I bought it is because I got to listen to it first. This is Alice in Chains. Alice in Chains. I've I've done a review on it. I've been I've probably uploaded. It. And we got Alice in Chains Dirt. I've listened to this album a couple times. It's pretty good. And I've listened to some of these right here. Except for that one right there. We got Corn's Issues. Corn's Untouchables. Corn, take the, take a look in the mirror. And Corn, see you on the other side. I've listened to those three right there. That one I don't think I've listened to. Onto the, come on. And we got Chevelle's Chevelle. And then Chevelle, this type of thinking, could do us in. And whoa, someone who's bought a Nickelback album. Nickelback, The Long Road. Then we got Systematic, somewhere in between. We got... I can't see what that says. I think that says Casey, and that's Creed. 
Creed and Nickelback? Coincidence? I don't think so. The best of Panther. I've not listened to that one. Mushroom Head X I I I. We got Soundgarden. Also, that's that's bad Motorfinger because I've listened to both of them. We got Queens of the Stone Age. System of a Down Toxicity. I have listened to that. We got Filters. Title of record. I have listened to it. It's a great songs on there. We got Velvet Revolver. Seether disclaimer. I've listened to halfway through that. Uh, to stop listening to it, to listen to one of my CDs over there. We got Madonna, the Impuglate Collection, and we got Rob Zombie, Marilyn Manson, Tool. We got Stains, Fourteen Shades of Grey, Lincoln Park, Meteora, Limp Biscuit, Significant. Uh, I've listened to about track six on there. Maybe track five. The Diary of Elisa Keys. That's for Eric K, whoever he is. That's Eminem album. Can't tell you what it is, really. That right there is Dave Matthew Bands, live in Chicago, December 19th, 1998. That's the same one, except part two of that. That, there's nothing there, it's just... CD of nothing. And we got a perfect circle. And we got, I think that's finger 11 that says on there. We got Chris, Christophina Aguilera, I think that's how you say her name. And then we got some Godsmack. Oh, and I don't think that that Ramstein was called Republic because that says Republic on it, so I don't know what that album's called. And we got Grand Royal by Beastie Boys, or maybe it's Hello Nasty. I don't know. The 420 Brothers. Stereophonic Soundwave. You got Savage Garden. I can't tell you who those two bands right there are because I've never listened to them. Three Doors Down, The Better Life. And Three Days Grace. And now let's see what these two CDs in here is all about. And then we got Valentine, f Fat Mix, Techno Rock Mix. Another one is by a band called Cradle of Filth, Damnation, and A Day. From Genesis to Nemesis. Oh, weird. Alright, well that was this little box right here. Let's close this bad boy up. <clears throat> Tell me if you've seen any, any ones in there that you thought were good. Uh, well, let's open up this bad boy. She told me she liked ACDC. She was not lying. Let's get this down. Ah, uh, the CD. I can't tell you who made this CD. If you watch this video and see this CD right here, can you please tell me who made it? Because I don't know who's made it. She doesn't know who made it either. She can't remember who made it. Now we got... This thing. Let's open it up. Why did everything turn black and white? Notice that? Except for that CD right there. The Sins of Prophecy. Oh, let's open. Bad boy. Alright. We got Foo Fighters one by one. And we got Metallica's The Black Album. I actually bought that album because I've Listen to it. I have that album. Then we got disc one of Metallica. I can't tell you what album this is, but this is not an album. This is like a compilation. We got Holy Diver. I don't know what album that is. Uh, I think it's just called Holy Diver. I don't know. We got Stone Sour. I'm not a big Stone Sour fan. I like Slipknot better. Then we got, I don't know who made this one. Let's see who made it. Ooh, it's by... Ozzy, Blizzard of Oz. Huh. I never knew who made that CD, I don't know. And we got Poison. Open up and say, oh. I think that's what its name is. Um, yeah. I haven't listened to it. Then we got the Eagles, Their Greatest Hits, 1971 through 1975. And then Eagles, Their Greatest Hits, 1971 through 1975. 
on and on to the next one. Famous musician David Robinson. Then we got Nazareth, Hair of the Dog. Meat, meatloaf, Bat Out of Hell 2, Back Into Hell. Huh. Then we got... Oh, I actually heard of this lady just not too long ago. Maybe an hour ago. Cats, Patsy Klein and Conway Twitty, Back to Back. And then we got Jackal Staying Alive. Let's just close that one up right there. We got Tom Petty. Uh, rest in peace, Tom Petty. I may have never listened to his music, but rest in peace. Uh, we got Wildflowers. I think that's what this album's called. And then we got Molly Hatchet, Super Hits. I've heard of Flirtin's Disaster. I played that rock band one. That's the only way I've heard of it. Come on. Then we got Eddie Money, Nothing to Lose. Then we got Best of Trance, Volume 2. Let's go on to the next one. Then we got J -j -j Johnny. Oh, I thought that was going to say Johnny Cash, but no. It says Johnny Lang, Lie to Me. Huh. I was just about to say Rest in Peace, Johnny Cash. That's Rascal Flats, Feels Like Today. This album right here, um, if you could tell me what album that is, I'd kind of like it. Because I can't tell you who made that one. Come on. Get back in, bang you. Because you don't want to get back in doesn't mean anything. And then we got, I think this is Clutch. And yeah, that's the end of this puppy. Let's close her up. I'm just... Closing it up right now. Now, let's continue on with this. Alright, let's look through here. I've actually. Alright, we got ACDC Highway to Hell. Except, I think these may have been live. I don't know. Okay. And we got the mystery, mystery album, I can't tell you who made. Can, if you watch this video and know who made this, can you please tell me? Because I honestly don't know who made it. We got ACDC Live. Then we got ACDC. For those about to rock, we salute you. ACDC, back in black. This lady wasn't kidding when she said she liked ACDC. ACDC, back in black. Oh, look, guess who? ACDC Ball Breaker. I think I've met this one before. ACDC The Razor's Edge. And ooh, special looking puppy right here. We got ACDC Voltage. Let's open it up. See what's inside. We got those right there. We got that right there to greet you when you open it. Then. ACDC's ACDC's If You Wanted Blood Ooh, What a horrendous picture to look at when you open it up Let's put these bad boys back where they were <clears throat> Actually no, let's just set them over here We'll kind of help her clean it up Because this kind of thing is in a mess And then we got Jagged Jagged Edge Hard. I don't know what that's about. Mm. Oh, look. Familiar. ACDC. 74 Jailbreak. Yeah, if you can see that. Put you back over there. Mm. ACDC. Are you, are you ready? ACDC. Blow up your video. Angus Young knew about this video before it was even released back in 1988 when this was released. Oh my gosh. I gotta blow my phone up now. I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna do that. ACDC. High voltage. Why did I get so happy there? Oh, we got us a weird looking one right here. We got a bunch of weird songs because I got high. 
she told me she used to be a pothead, but dang. Eminem versus Biggie, that's when you know you're a pothead. You listen to Snoop Dogg. <laughs> Not saying that everyone who listens to Snoop Dogg's is a pothead. Dang, I just offended half the people on YouTube. Dang it. I don't care. It's just YouTube. People say stuff all the time. Then we got Country and Western, Volume 4. Thanks for such a great description. Let's keep her going. We got Kian Kimar 2007. Huh. Nice name. I'd hate to be you when I was born. And we got Ditto CDs in the van. Ditto. It says Ditto Life for Rent. Huh. Okay. I don't know who Ditto is. Can you tell me who Ditto is? D-I-D-O is. Then we got Collective Soul Youth. That's a nice picture to look at. <laughs> I've actually listened to this album. Ditto's a singer. I don't care, Corey. And yeah, I've actually listened to this album. I haven't listened to the entire thing because I kind of got bored through it. Um, track 7, I think it was. Then we got Black Savage. We sold our soul for rock and roll. Now let's get her on. And we got Mary Merrill Haggard down every round road. Oh, that says road. And let's just move that out of the way because that ain't an album. Is it? No, that ain't an album. This right here, um, um, it used to be a little boy, but now it's nothing. Then, now, we got, last but not least, not in computer. Let me, let's see what she says on it. Now, thanks. Thanks for greeting us to having that note. Well, let me just put this all back right here. Now, she left some album covers back in here. Let's look at some of them. We got Alice in Chains, Alice in Chains. Kid Rock. I can't remember what this one's called. I think it's called The Little Devil. Something like that. Gangsta Wannabe. Hmm. If it looks good, you'll see it. If it sounds good, you'll hear it. If it's marketed right, you'll buy it. But if it's real, you'll feel it. Said by, guess who, Kid Rock. That's the quote right there. This giant thing's because he thought he was some big gangster cool guy back in his day. It's not really that cool, honestly. They probably released one good song, in my opinion. We got Molly Hatchet Super Hits. Oh, guess what? She went through her emo phase. Evanescence Fallen. Although maybe she just liked Evanescence. Or maybe that was her daughter's. I know who made this one. That's Pink Floyd. So maybe that one album that we did see was a Pink Floyd. What's in here? Mm. Then we got Velvet Revolver with Scott Weiland. And guess who's slashing it? And I think this is the last, yeah, this is the last thing on the list. This is System of a Down's Toxicity. I've told, I probably told you I listened to this one. It's, it's quite a good one. Well, that was the, um, to that and that. Well, thank you for watching this. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.